Okay, this is a demonstration of two loads in series. What I want you to note right off is we're looking at 244 volts. Okay, these are 120 volt light bulbs, each one of them 75 watts. Now, if I turn this on, now the light bulbs are glowing like they should, and, and so on. If I was to disconnect one light bulb, then it kills both of them because they're in series. And that's all as you'd expect for a series low. Now let's take a look at the voltage to each one of these. Now if you look you see I've taken this probe and put it here between the two light bulbs so I'm testing this light bulb because my other probes right there. You can see that voltage is 123 okay let's switch it to the other light okay now if you look I have one probe here and one probe there so I'm testing this light and let's see what our voltage is okay it's 121 so we're a couple of volts different because no two loads are actually identical so now what we're gonna do is we're going to put different loads in there. I'm going to put a 60 watt light bulb in the right and leave the 75 on the left. Okay, now I've turned them on and you notice the light bulbs are not the same brightness. The one on the left which is a 75 watt bulb is somewhat dimmer than the one on the right. Now it's not real obvious it's, uh, it's more obvious as I look at it than it is in the in the uh, video but understand I put a 60 watt bulb here it should be putting out less light than the 75. It's not it's putting out more light than the 75. So, why is that? Oops. Again, I have my probes on this 60 watt light bulb. And let's look at the voltage. Okay, I've got 141 volts. Now that's a 120 volt light bulb, but I got 141 volts. Now let's switch and check what the voltage to the other light bulb, the 75 watt light bulb is. Okay, we're set up now with our probes across the 75 watt bulb. Let's turn it on and let's check our voltage. Now we're at 102. So I'm at 102 on the 75 and 141 on the 60. This bulb is only getting 102, which is 20 volts less than it, it should. This one is getting 20 volts more than it, than it should because they're different size loads. This one is probably going to burn up because it's, it's got excessive voltage to the bulb. This one is just not going to perform very well because uh, it's getting too low a voltage. So that's what happens in series loads when the loads are unbalanced. Now like I said in HVAC, we seldom do series loads anyway. There's some specialty things we do series loads in. But, but for prime movers, fans, things like that, we generally do not want to do these in series because there's too many problems can, can come about. So, I hope this helps understand about unbalanced series loads.